Hello, uh, Music Bear here. Uh, I hope you're enjoying uh, your uh, elements, um, as I like to call LMMS. Probably heard that before. Um, I'm going to show you how to. Um, this this is going to be a little short um, uh, tutorial, um, and I'm only going to show you how to get a perfect synchronization on. Uh, this guy here and calf winter delay you s you know if if you right click this tempo button here we cannot um, uh, set a, uh, 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 a synchronization on it um, but we actually don't have to because if we use a little trick um, it is possible anyway so um, what we're going to do is to take this uh, dial here and you can listen here uh, this is the delay I have here in, 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 in this setup but I want to p have it perfectly 116 okay so I go in here and I say connect to controller and I use user controller and a control 1 and OK User controller one has these, um, and now you can see it starts to move. Uh, user controller, you probably already uh, figured out what I'm then going to do. Then I'm just going to um, yes, right click here and say sim tempo sync to one sixteenth, and then it moves like that, and that's not very helpful because that doesn't sound good. But all I have to do here is to go into the control and take the, uh, uh, the, the, the uh, uh, amount, modulation amount, and pull it up to zero. Probably just, uh, whoops, zero there. And then this uh, uh, dial is totally frozen because now I don't have any um, uh, uh, movement on it uh, because I've taken the amp away. But if you try to, to play it, it's not completely clean. But I don't have to have it clean now because all I have to do is... Um, there you are. Then I just have to right click it here and read out the value which is uh, 166.6 so I can copy that value 165 it says but that doesn't matter and then I just have to remove the controller remove connection and then I have to paste the value here and it was 66 so we're going to put it to 66 that was that and now if I try and play where is it down there listen yeah i just l stopped it and made a recording just to show you that the synchronization is perfect you can see here this is a kick and in here then we have the the delay and it is the exact same position so the delay uh, and of course it goes on but you can't see that inside the pattern but it's, it's pop uh, possible here to see how the delay falls and you can also listen to it I can put it up here again listen <laughs> Yes, that's how to synchronize a dial that doesn't have tempo synchronization um, and you could also do that with um, BSTs of course uh, and the value that I found here uh, is not necessarily uh, true for, for, for everything because uh, 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 some of the dials are arbitrary in, in, uh, uh, in, in, in the span 
uh, and also I used 140 BMP in, in, in this example. If you have another BMP, then the, the, the synchronization will of course be different. But it doesn't matter because it's really fast and easy to um, um, to do this. Uh, so um, yeah, that's about it. Um, see you next time and bye-bye. Um,